Hey guys, welcome to my first unboxing video. <laughs> I'll uh, unpack it in. Finally got this today from Amazon. Place it off amazon.com.au back to this from the US. So let's see what I got. Way. The Bushnell H20. Waterproof or H20, H2O, <laughs> waterproof binoculars, 8x42, um, and it's got all the instructions in the different languages, French, Espanol, Deutsch, Italiano, and PRT, is that Portuguese? Uh, that's the Amazon receipt, a little screen glares there. Uh, as you can see, makes the images eight times closer. Hmm. Decent looking package, decent weight rather. But who cares about the box? Let's see what's inside it. Ooh. Extra piece of uh, cardboard, which is a bonus. What's that? Bushnell branded. It's a Bushnell branded strap, which is cool. And next, that, that's the box. Turf the box. Keep these plastics away from the ocean and your kids. <laughs> um, register now. Visit bushnell.com forward slash registration to register your new optics and get access to future product info and announcements from Team Bushnell. Well done. The instruction manual. Okay. In uh, one, in Korean, Chinese, Chinese two. Traditional and simplified, Japanese, Portuguese, Italiano, German, French, Spanish, and oh, English. Here we go. That's what I need. But uh, we'll get into the instructions in a bit. I can't wait to see this actual product. Oh, nice little carry case. It doesn't seem too flimsy. Got a little strap thing as well, which is not bad. And here we are. As with most other reviews, you would have seen off this product it comes with a uh, little microfiber cloth. And I can't wait, I've been waiting weeks for this. The actual binoculars. Oh yeah. Oh, it comes off. That is amazing. A decent weight to it as well. It's not as light as I thought it would be. But, all right. What does it say there? Bushnell 8x42 H2O waterproof FOV field of vision 365 FT feet. the Bushnell logo there. All right, I'm gonna go have a play with this and uh, I'll be back. So it's been about a month and a half since I received this in the post. I decided to give it a go in the field, AKA our reserve, just in case uh, somebody called the police on a weirdo with binoculars constantly looking out the window. Uh, we can't venture out too far just yet due to government restrictions with COVID and all of that. But I really am happy with how sturdy this unit feels. The rubberized grips are really good. I don't think or feel that it's gonna slip out of my hands. I don't think that I'll be able to crack the body easily by knocking it around, so I am quite confident with it. It was really hard to take a video on what it's like looking through it, so I resorted to taking a few pictures. 
So place it on a tree and focus it on a point about 130 meters or 142 yards away, as you can see there. And this is the result. I love how clear the picture is. It's just amazing. I didn't even notice that there was a house there, to be honest. I also really like the fact that you can adjust the eye relief to suit you. So regardless of whether you wear glasses or not, you can adjust the eye cups to uh, suit your needs, which is really cool. So here I moved it to another spot and pointed it in the direction of a, a little hill in the distance. This is really clear and I wasn't shaky at all when I was holding it at full zoom standing up. Um, I didn't realize unfortunately till I came home that the picture I took uh, knocked the binos slightly off focus and it moved the, the focus to a tree. So I paid 114 Australian for this or 72 US dollars off Amazon and I think it's well worth the money for what I need it for. Um, in my humble opinion, I am really happy with my purchase and I know that once the restrictions are lifted, this will get a lot of use once I'm out glassing again. Anyway, thanks for your time and thanks for watching. Hope this helped.